This is a chicken egg, and this is a field of grass. I will make a $100 bet with you that you can't break this egg by tossing it in the air. The only rules are you have one chance and it has to land on this plot of grass. To make this more logistically simple, David. Dude, I thought we were filming tomorrow. Oh, sorry. Hello. We'll take your place in this bet. David, here's this egg. Easy money. What are you gonna do? I'm going to toss it as hard as I can right at the ground here. No! <laughs> are you kidding me? I right, about this? I'll give I you need... two chances. No! <laughs> I don't have the money to pay you. <laughs> so what exactly did I do to this egg to make it super strong? Well, absolutely nothing. While filming another project using eggs and Teslas, my close friend Brandon noticed that none of the eggs that he threw on the grassy area on the side of the road broke, no matter how hard he threw them. Oh, that's gonna break. That's gonna break. No, it's gonna <laughs> it didn't break. Considering how there are egg drop competitions around the world which use wildly engineered contraptions, I wanted to test the limitations to this little party trick by seeing how high an egg would survive using zero protection other than grass. Since our throwing abilities are the limiting factor, we needed a way to get higher, and we had just the idea. Ah! This drone will perfectly simulate if a chicken was flying really high and decided to poop out an egg, cause that's how that works. And because this is a kid friendly episode, we decided to dress up and take on the roles as concerned cocks from the ground. Nice cock! And to clarify, the eggs that we've been using come from your typical roided up farm chicken. Now, all we have to do is fly to different heights and push this button to poop the egg. The first egg drop is going to be at 50 feet. 50 feet? Yeah, all right. There goes the countdown. In three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is there anything? Nothing, not a crack. With absolutely no damage at 50 feet, we're gonna go up to 75 feet using the same egg. In three, two, one. Oh my god, Anything? look at that! We're gonna bring this up to 100 feet. If you fall from 100 feet, you're gonna splash. To give you some sense of scale, 100 feet is about the length of 110 Subway footlong sandwiches stacked end to end. 100 feet egg drop in three, two, one. <laughs> no! <laughs> what? Look at this! Dude! I don't believe it, 100 feet. This is unreal. Eggs That's like eight unreal. stories. That's an eight story building. No way. This goes against everything that we've been told. I'm taking this back. <laughs> <laughs> so far, an egg can withstand a pitch into the ground and an unprotected 100 foot drop into grass. But that same egg will easily crack if you gently tap it on the side of a bowl. Why? If you look at the side profile of an egg, you'll notice it has a similar shape to Arches and dome structures are incredibly strong because not a single point supports the entire applied load. This means the same physics principles also apply to an egg. Take an egg, put it in your palm, and try squeezing as hard as you can. I'm doing this in my car to prove a point. <clears throat> Can't do it. Can't. Do it. And this makes so much sense from a nature standpoint. A fertilized egg has to be kept warm, so if a big fat cock sits on it, it won't break. But when a small chick is ready to hatch, a peck with their tiny beaks is enough to break through. Now let's get back to dropping eggs. Let's go up to 150, guys. 150? Ready? All right, I want to see if I can track it, but. All right, three, two, one, drop. <gasps> Here it comes. Oh! No! No! What? <laughs> Are you that kidding me? Insane. 150! Oh Two, one, drop. <gasps> Here it comes. Oh! No! No! What? <laughs> like, of all the things that we're gonna fail in this project, I'm amazed by this, and I'm even more amazed by this. Like, this should have crashed the drone by now. <laughs> So right before we reached our 300 foot drop test, a strong gust of wind actually came over, pushed our rubber chicken head into the propellers and caused our drone to crash. I looked up the Guinness World Record for the highest unprotected egg drop, and what I was able to find was that somebody actually took a helicopter and dropped an egg 700 feet 
onto a golf course. But just because we couldn't break that record in this video, doesn't mean we couldn't figure out how high we can go theoretically by just using some napkin math. Dropped at 700 feet, an egg will reach around 100 miles per hour right before it hits the ground. That is right around an egg's terminal velocity, assuming the drag coefficient of an egg is 0.3. So with that said, we can lazily hypothesize that an egg is unbreakable if dropped at any height and it lands on a patch of grass. Now obviously there are going to be some exceptions and variables at play here, but right now we're just having a fun discussion because I would never have guessed that something that literally has the words fragile written on its packaging would have even a chance of surviving a drop at any height. 